All right, guys, we're going to be talking about the landmine overhead press, why you should be doing it, and why it's a good alternative. So when looking at positions we want ourselves or our clients to get in, uh, the overhead position is usually a, a pretty difficult one. Be it tightness and restriction from the pec minor, the lats, or even the ribs, this is usually a challenging position to get the general public into. So instead of just staying away from this functional movement pattern, uh, we wanna eventually get our clients to get in it uh, and to get in it safely. So if a client or yourself does have a little bit of difficulty getting into a barbell overhead press, this is an alternative that's actually superior to using dumbbells to get into that position. What usually happens when we give clients with mobility restrictions, we end up in a clavicular angle with the arm path. We, we want to be over the head and over the shoulders when we're pressing at finishing with the bicep opposite the ear. This usually is hard to accomplish with barbell or dumbbell, like I just said. Using the landmine setup does allow you to travel in a somewhat straight path. The key here, which most people do miss, is getting your head and your whole body underneath the weight. We don't want that clavicular angle pressing that weight. We want our arms to eventually get straight above our head with our bicep next to our ear. Personally, I like to change up the stance into a staggered stance or maybe even a half kneeling. It allows the body to travel underneath the bar a little bit easier and you don't feel like you're leaning forward or pushing your hips back too much. Okay, so from the get-go, when you're setting this one up, make sure you're almost tucking that elbow forward and using your lats as a shelf for the weight. So from there, we're thinking about driving the barbell straight up while tucking our elbow forward. We don't want to be leaning in too much more so than our mobility allows, that we start to shrug the weight up in the air. So other than progressing, making the weight heavier, we can work on our range and getting more overhead by moving our body close to the bar, thus making ourselves press in a more vertical fashion. Next time you're near the barbell and you're complaining about the overhead press, try it out with the landmine and work that range. This is one of the most functional things you could do in the gym, and I'll see you guys in the next one.